miss. Hey guys, this is Kim Winjack, Associate Instructor for the Impact Zone, and uh, I don't know about you, but I'm pretty excited that the NHL lockout's over. So in light of that, I got my stick, and I got my gloves, and since I can't seem to hit the net, and I can't score, I'm going to do what everyone does when they can't score. I'm going to find out a way to make the team, I'm going to drop my stick, I'm going to drop my gloves, but I'm not going to grab a jersey. Because there's no one really in here that I, I want to fight. I don't think I'd make out too well against Steve over there. So uh, I'm going to grab a mid iron And we're going to work on our dynamic number one. And that is the flat left wrist through the impact zone. Now, the flat left wrist is often referred to as the master dynamic. And that's because everything, all your other dynamics through your swing rely on your flat left wrist being intact. Um, I can show you uh, just how important it is simply by breaking four out of the five dynamics simply by breaking down that flat left wrist there. What have I done here? I've casted the club so it's not going to have that dynamic number five straight plane line. I've thrown away my leg. Um, I've moved my swing bottom rearward because I'm going to be contacting the ground back here. And um, the, the flat left wrist is obviously one of them. So what we're going to do is we're going to work on maintaining that flat left wrist through the impact zone just by pushing on this stick here and with that weight there we can really ingrain what it feels like to maintain that flat left wrist through the impact zone. So we're just going to push it, maintaining that flat left wrist. And that's all it is. So just work on that. You're going to move your swing bottom forward. You're going to maintain more leg. You're going to have that flat left wrist through the impact zone. You'll start making better contact. Start shooting better scores. Because remember, if you want to improve your game, you've got to improve your impact. It's as simple as that. If you want to learn more about the impact zone, you can go to the link under this video. It'll bring you to their website. Also, if you're looking for impact zone specific instruction, you can contact the Greens at Brock. The information for that is also under this video. I'm Cam Winjack. Thanks a lot for watching.